The number of forces in the area was unprecedented. More than 800 firefighters assisted by 150 fire trucks and 40 designated aircrafts participated in putting out the fire while many countries responded to the call and sent for help. The fire progressed at an alarming speed of almost 2 km per hour and after 24 hours the following picture emerges. Tanks of fire reached Yemin Ord, near Etzion, Ein Hod, Ein Hod South, Kibbutz Megadim and Highway 4 in the west up to Tirat Carmel in the north. For comparison's sake, the area of the fire is equal to half of the city of Haifa. Kibbutz Beit Oren, which overlooks Death Bend, is in the middle of the fire. All odds are against it. The first report of a brush fire is received at 11.09 from a resident of Osfia who sees the fire. A flight instructor who spotted the fire from the air reports it and continues to fly over the area. The first fire engine from Haifa's Park Carmel fire station arrives at the scene of the fire at approximately 11.20 and quickly asks for assistance. Sorry, 
11.30 a.m. El Adriven, a Haifa High School student who hears about the fire, calls his mother and asks her to take him to the meeting point near the Moon Prison. 16-year-old Elad, an only child, has been volunteering in Haifa's firefighting services.